Hunter Biden's lawyer on Friday demanded a congressional ethics watchdog review rep. Marjorie Taylor Greene's conduct during a hearing earlier this week, where she showed sexually explicit but censored photos of the first son with alleged prostitutes. This week, your colleague has lowered herself, and by extension, the entire House of Representatives, to a new level of abhorrent behavior that blatantly violates House ethics rules and standards of official conduct. Abby Lowell wrote in a letter to the Office of Congressional Ethics, obtained by the Hill, if the OCE takes its responsibilities seriously, it will promptly and decisively condemn and discipline Ms. Green for her latest actions. The attorney wrote, the Georgia Republican raised eyebrows Wednesday during a House Oversight Committee hearing that featured two IRS whistleblowers, Gary Shapley and Joseph Ziegler, who claimed the government's five-year-long probe of Hunter Biden was rife with favoritism. Green warned viewers that parental discretion is advised and cautioned that the following images are disturbing beefo. Ray she exhibited photographs of the now 53-year-old first son engaged in graphic sexual acts with a series of women. During her line of questioning, the congresswoman was attempting to establish whether Hunter had violated the Federal Man Act of 1910, which prohibits the transportation of women across state lines for the purpose of prostitution or debauchery, or for any other immoral purpose, should we be displaying this? Mr. Chairman, Ranking Member Janie Raskin DMD grumbled as Green displayed the images obtained from Hunter Biden's infamous abandoned laptop. Now more than ever, the House has a duty to make loud and clear that it does not endorse, condone, or agree with her outrageous undignified conduct and brazen violations of the standards of official conduct that do not reflect creditably on the House of Representatives. Lowell said in his letter the Office of Congressional Ethics, established by the House of Representatives, is an independent, nonpartisan entity tasked with receiving and reviewing allegations of misconduct involving congressional lawmakers and staffers. The watchdog may also refer matters to the House Ethics Committee if it finds evidence of misconduct. Lowell accuses Green of using her time during the hearing to generate some clicks online and fundraise by harassing and embarrassing Hunter Biden. The lawyer further called the Republican firebrand as actions on Wednesday a political stunt rather than evaluate the credibility of the IRS agent's testimony or review our tax laws. Ms. Green sought to use the power of her office to generate some clicks online, fundraise, and provide sensationalist clips for Fox News at the expense of harassing and embarrassing Mr. Biden, a private citizen. Lowell argued this political stunt by Ms. Green will go down as a historic event unbecoming of any member of Congress and beneath the dignity of the House of Representatives. He added Green's office did not respond to the post's request for comment.